Hey everyone, it's Pokemon Runner 5 here, and welcome to our let's play of Pokemon Black. So let's just get right into it. Hi there, welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Juniper, everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. That's right. The world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. Pokemon have mysterious powers. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon. Living and working together, we complement each other. We help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks. Having Pokemon battle one another is particularly popular, and it deepens the bonds between people and Pokemon. And that is why I research Pokemon. Sorry if that was a little off camera. Well, that's enough for me. Could you tell me about yourself? Are you a boy or a girl? You're a boy, right? I'd like to know your name. Please tell me. Okay, so I'm going to use my name. Your name is Mike. The brightness might be a little too bright, like that should be better. So your name is Mike. What a wonderful name. Well then, I'm going to introduce you to your two best friends. This young man is Charon. We can be, he can be a little difficult, but he's a very honest person. This young woman is Bianca. She's a little flighty, but she works very hard. I think you three have potential, so I'm going to give you a very, very important Pokemon. Mike, this moment you choose the Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey. Your story will truly begin. During your journey, you will meet many Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of view. I really hope you find what is important to you in all of these travels. That's right, befriend new people and Pokemon and grow as a person. That is the most important goal for your journey. Let's go visit the world of Pokemon. Autumn. So, yeah, I'd, this is the first month I guess it starts out on, because this is how it started out on white for me. Of course, I go off screen again. Mike, I heard from Professor Juniper. We can have a Pokemon? I can't say Professor for some reason. What's keeping Bianca? Am I a little late again? Sorry. Blah, 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 blah. Bianca, I've known for 10 years that you have no sense of time. But seriously, today's the day we can get a Pokemon Professor Juniper. I know. Sorry, Mike. Sorry, Charon. So where are the Pokemon? They were delivered to Mike's house, so Mike gets to pick first. Naturally. Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box. Okay, Mike. You go first and take a peek at the gift box. Let's see the Pokemon right now. So, I'm, I want Tepig. Um, I brought three Pokemon. One for you and one for each of your friends. Please settle your choices politely. Enjoy your Pokemon. Fresh for Juniper. So yeah, I'm gonna go with Tepic. Mike chose Tepic. Yay. <laughs> okay, I'll take this Pokemon. Charon, that one's yours. So Charon's gonna get Oshawa. Bianca's gonna get Snivy. Hey, how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? Oh, never mind. I wanted Oshawa from the start anyway. Everyone has chosen a Pokemon, so that's that. Hey, I know. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca, even though they're still weak Pokemon, you shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Oh, don't be a worry wart. These little ones are weak, like you said. We have to let them battle so they'll get stronger. It's settled, Mike. Get ready for a Pokemon battle. So our first battle is against Bianca. And uh, it's going to be Tepig versus Snivy. And sorry if the screen keeps getting lighter and everything. I'm just trying to see if it's on screen. So she sent out Snivy. And I'm going to send out Tepig, obviously. So we're going to tap. Now, usually, maybe not usually, but 
I was expecting like a Leer from Snivy, but guess not. The Tepeg seems stronger, because I already got him in yellow. That might just be because he has less HP than me. I don't know. I'm just assuming. So I think we just won. Yep. And almost a level up. The Pokemon both sides did their best. Mike got $500 for winning. And she just destroyed my room. Wow. Mike, you're going to be an awesome trainer someday, I can tell. No doubt. Uh, Bianca, would you take a look around? Whoa, what happened? Wow, Pokemon are amazing. So little, but so strong. I'm so glad that I get to have a Pokemon. Oh, um, sorry about your room, Mike. You... are completely hopeless. Sorry, I'm just fixing up the thing. Here, I'll restore your Pokemon for you. Mike's Pokemon needs to be fixed up, too. Hey, Charon, how about you battle, too? With all you know, I'm sure you could battle without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. I believe you're right. It'll be no problem for me to keep the room from getting any messier. Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have fun battling. It's decided you'll be my opponent in our first Pokemon battle. Let's see what you can do, Oshawa. I'm assuming that he meant, like, him and Oshawott's first Pokemon battle, because I just battled. So, um... I'm assuming it's gonna be another exact same thing. Tackles, that thing's gonna use, like, Tail Whip, I think it has. We'll see. Ah, oh, critical hit. Wait. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that was funny, actually. So, um, yep, there's one, and we get leveled up. So that was, okay, that was actually, I was getting a little worried in that one just because that critical hit. I didn't think I was gonna get one. But yeah, so. I made a strange blunder in my first battle, but this feeling I have, I'm finally a trainer. But first, we better go apologize to your mother about this messed up room. Oh, I'd better come too. Hey, you better. So, uh, that's really, I guess that should be the end for part one. Um, this Poke at 95. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, um, if you want to subscribe, it's up to you. And, yeah, so thanks guys, see ya.